This is Serenity Ledger's video for this uh, 2003 um, Auto Trail Dakota uh, based on the Mercedes Sprinter. Uh, and it's worth mentioning this is also a uh, automatic, uh, which is quite rare. And um, whenever we get them in, or be it the Dakotas or any other sort of early automatic for that matter, they uh, do prove to be extremely popular. So the video is being made in connection with the photographs and editorial we've already seen and uh, it also enables us to sort of point out any markings to the camper and to give you a really sort of brutal description of it. Um, so the D Dakota is sort of quite a high-end motorhome uh, when it was new um, and this is a very nice example to say the least. Um, this side you have a locker uh, to the rear which enables you to access underneath the fixed bed. Um, water tank filler etc is along here as an outside shower in case you want to wash your feet off uh, gas locker uh, cab very good uh, condition wise really nice not suffering from any sort of nasty blemishes or certainly hasn't got any rust it's very very good and to this side you've got a uh, locker here which you can use just use for storing uh, odds and ends underneath here and then this again is to access uh, underneath the lounge area and again condition wise which is very good and it's parked up against our tree here but uh, you can just about make out everything on the back um, rear ladder and um, tow bar and even if you're not going to use the tow bar to pull anything it's worth keeping it on there because it's a uh, good protection against anybody running to the back of you right internally so this is a four berth uh, motorhome as you can see um, this area here changes into a double bed if you want it to condition of the there's a horrible fly in here we're trying to get that out by leaving the door open a uh, condition of the upholstery is lovely very very good um, the captain chairs on the front one swivels one does not because obviously there's a handbrake in the way but this one does swivel around and integrates into the lounge um, it's got uh, obviously power steering and central locking all that sort of aftermarket cruise control and there's your automatic uh, gearbox um, this would be classed as a sort of low-line camper so you can see up here it is used for storage as opposed to um, uh, having an overhead cab bed just turn that brightness down a tad excuse me a minute while I just uh, have to do all this whilst I can't do it there we go right okay so this is the um that was me messing about with the filters uh gives you a good insight obviously as to the uh, that's a bar area as to the interior complete interior layout for the motorhome there's lots of room uh, they're really finished to a lovely standard without question um your fridge freezer your um um, um full-size oven hob etc that's all very very clean as you'd want it to be uh, decent sized sink water trail sig signature on the uh, drain uh, carved wooden board um, your microwave can go in there if you if you want one uh, additional wardrobe here blown air truma blown air heating all the way around um, and then this really really good sort of rear bedroom which can be separated from the rest of the camper that's another uh, sorry another that's a television um, uh, area up here uh, here the uh, previous owner had a cable running out of here because he had a bracket on here his TV obviously didn't fit inside the um, this compartment so again uh, all the covers for the mattress etc are unmarked nothing on them at all curtains cushions everything's in lovely lovely condition it really is and then your bathroom to the side here uh, you can have a shower in there electric flush Tetford toilet little vanity unit you might be asking where's the sink well the sink is here integrated into the bedroom but with a little um, uh, cover on it like that so it doesn't look as though you've got a sink in the bedroom I suppose that's one way of looking at it there we go okay uh, as I said internal condition certainly matches the outside it uh, really is quite lovely to say the least that completes Serenity Leisure's video for this 2003 Auto Trail Dakota.